The Santa Maria Airport is expanding its Forest Service air attack base. Fox 11 reporter Annika Abbott has details about today's announcement and what it means for everybody in the region. The Santa Maria Airport plays a crucial role in firefighting efforts. They are now expanding the air attack base to improve the state's response to wildfires. It's one of right now two bases, permanent bases, that can handle the DC-10 air tankers. And so we, uh, we reach uh, up into Northern California, as far east, uh, almost to Nevada. There are three reloading pits at the airport and they are adding a fourth. This temporary red tank mixes the fire retarded and will be replaced with a permanent one soon. As the aircraft have gotten larger over time, it gets more and more difficult for safety reasons to keep the large aircraft coming in and out with the smaller aircraft. And so it enables us to bring the large aircraft or very large air tankers, VLAT is what they're called, over here on this side of the airport to kind of keep them out of the mix of the smaller aircraft. Pit 4 will also increase retardant capacity and improve efficiency for fire response. In 2020, they've used about 800,000 gallons of fire retardant from the Santa Maria Air Base alone. This is a very large air tanker sitting behind me, and it can hold up to about 4,000 gallons, depending, and then some of them even more than that. With fire season now lasting all year long in California, this expansion of the Santa Maria Base is very important. The Central Coast, along with uh, Southern California, is very prone to fires. Uh, the ecosystem here is one of the most prone ecosystems to fire in the world. In Santa Maria, Annika Abbott, Fox 11 News.